I'm so excited to show you guys this. Okay, so I just got this package from Vibe. They reached out to me and we're actually going to be doing a giveaway, you guys. On my IG, you guys will get to win $250 to buy anything you want on their website. In order to enter the giveaway, you guys, you can subscribe to my channel. Also, follow me and them on Instagram. I will leave the details all down below so that you guys can enter. And also, don't forget to check out my IG because that's where the giveaway will be. So, let's see what they sent me. I love this wrapping paper, by the way. It's super cute. Look at this. So cute! They sent me this red skirt with the stripe on the side. And for those of you who are interested, I got a size small. The small I can tell is going to fit me absolutely perfect. Can I just say like how cute their logo is? It's just so cute. Look at this pink hat. This is so adorable. If you're wearing like a black bodysuit or a very like baby pink bodysuit, that'd be so cute. I was looking for the perfect pair of black, and you know what? That's so funny, I actually forgot that they were sending me these. I absolutely forgot and I've been looking for a pair. I believe I got this one in a medium to be safe. Yes, I got in a size medium. Let's see what's next in here. Oh, look at this, look at this. All the sporty looks are coming out today. It says too hottie and it's kind of like a baseball tee sort of material, like a sports tee. This one I got in a size small as well and it's gonna fit perfect. I can see myself doing like a pair of just plain jeans. And Oh, this is, oh my god, this is so cute. This is their tee with their logo on it. Got the black one, and the logo is in like a very baby pink. I thought this was like very nice when I just want to be super, super comfy. I got it in a size small, and it does give you like a lot of room. What else do we got here? Ooh, we got some gold going on here. Oh my god, I can't wait to see this. Oh my god, oh my god, what is this? <gasps> oh my god. That is so cute, humble. Oh my God, this is so adorable. This is so cute. It says humble and it's like in gold and like a 3D lettering. And then they sent me the matching shorts so I can wear it like an outfit. Thank you guys so much. So they sent me this like very sporty gray dress. It has a stripe around the top there. Looks like it's off the shoulder and they sent it to me in a size size medium so it's gonna be like a very comfortable fit especially for something that you can just like quickly put on okay what is the army here uh oh I'm getting excited oh my god these are so cute track pants army track pants with the yellow on the side and guess what you guys the tank top that I'm wearing is the exact same yellow as the stripe. Oh my god, this is so adorable when I want to be like super, super casual. The medium, perfect, because the medium, I like it to be nice and comfortable on my legs. Oh my god, you guys, their stuff is so cute. Today is Tuesday. God, I'm always forgetting my days. This is horrible. This is what happens when you're just like constantly working. You're like, what day is it? I have to go to the grocery store. I feel like my fridge is like completely empty. By the way, I am wearing my humble top. How cute is this top? And I'm also rocking my red lip. I just felt like really going out today. Yesterday, I did not have a good day, you guys. Let me tell you, so bad, so bad. It was really, really bad, you guys. It just, it was just not a good day. Um, I think I'm actually gonna make a video about it because seriously, like in all honesty, it's not a joke. Um, and I really think that it's gonna kind of, it's gonna kind of be like my lazy eye video where I kind of open up. Um, you know, it's something that's new in my life and it's kind of a new challenge and I think that a lot of women will be able to relate. So I think I'm gonna kind of work on that, but it's not gonna be in this video because I don't wanna put like a damper on this video. I need to do some meal prep because I have like no, no food to eat. I finished up my stir fry, it was so good. If you guys didn't see that recipe, make sure you guys check out that vlog. I will leave the link up above. But we're gonna go do a little bit of grocery shopping. Um, what I might do is I think I have like literally two new videos I need to edit for you guys. So when I film a video, just so that you guys kind of know, you guys might find it interesting. Um, because Amy does it differently. Like, Amy's able to film today and put the video up tonight. I'm just like, I'm not at that point. I don't know if I ever will be. It's just, it just does not work with, like, how I plan things out. It just, I don't know. I just, I can't do it. What I like to do is, if I'm filming this this week, then you're going to see it next week. So, as I'm filming this right now, I have a video that was from last week that's going up today. So, just in case you guys want, like, a background kind of thing as to how I kind of work. <coughs> God bless myself. 
I don't know why we say that, but I always say it. I like to perfect things, and I like to make sure everything is like in order, and I feel like it's just too fast for me. My mood is very off this week, you guys. Like, it's just very, very off. I'm usually like extremely bubbly, and that's why this morning I was like, you need a red lip, you need to go out and feel cute, because it's just, it just really helps to like boost up my mood. If you guys are ever having like a down sort of day or a down week, try to find things that kind of, um, that make you happy, that boost up your mood. You know what I mean? For me, it's music. Music can like change my entire mood. Um, so find something that you guys enjoy. For me, it's getting all like beautiful and pretty. That's what makes me feel good and getting like dressed and feeling good. And um, music definitely does help me. Um, if you like to do a certain activity, go out and do that. The gym is a very good like stress reliever or if you're in a bad mood I find for me it just it's my getaway and it's my place to kind of like just be alone the gym has been going great you guys I have been feeling amazing I've been having my matcha a lot of you guys have been saying why don't you do decaf coffee it's just right now I'm just enjoying that that bamboo you know coffee alternative or substitute that I found I'm just enjoying it I bought it, I wasted like $12 on it, so I'm just going to use it in the meantime. I can have decaf coffee, there's nothing wrong with it. I'm actually fine, I haven't been, I only drink coffee on the weekends when I go to breakfast. I'm not completely eliminating it, I know it's kind of confusing because it's like, you're not eliminating your matcha, but you're eliminating your coffee. I'm honestly, you guys, I'm just trying something out. I feel like I don't want to be dependent on both of them. So because I can't find a substitute for my matcha and I don't want to find a substitute, then I'm going to find one for my coffee. I feel like personally I fixed my low blood pressure issue. Um, it's just not that I don't feel those weak episodes anymore. Just my mood has been off like since yesterday. It's, it's because it's around my period and it's just, I don't know, it's just like this new thing I've been experiencing. But like I said, I think I'm going to make a new video full on talking about it. I mean, it's not going to be the most, like, positive video, which I don't like. That's why I don't like making those videos. But at the end of the day, I really think it's going to help a lot of women, especially if you guys are going through something similar or if you guys are starting to. So if you guys want me to kind of talk about it and if this kind of sounds interesting to you, let me know down below and I will make the video for you guys. So I'm going to go and pick up a few groceries and we'll see how it goes after. You guys, there's only one more pair of organic bananas, so we're going to pick up these. I need some more of these mini cucumbers and I also need a tomato. Yeah, I need some more of my pita breads. These guys are the ones that I use for my chicken burgers, so I'm low on those. I've been making that a lot for lunch actually lately. I actually wrote down my list this time, you guys. Almond milk. It's so funny, you guys, because I used to love having bagels, and now I just don't even crave them anymore. You guys, I think today's my lucky day. There was one more cilantro left, one more Lilydale, and one more organic banana. Like, this is so weird. And I think I need chicken. No, I don't need chicken. But I need my chicken burgers. Let me show you guys. Please tell me you have them. Yes. So I get these guys. They're actually on sale. Is it these ones? No, something looks different about them. I am horrible with names, you guys. Like, I don't save anything. It looks like these. Pup style chicken strips? No, breaded whole fillets. This one. I love these in my sandwich. Oh my God. Oh my god, you guys, I'm not gonna lie, these look so good, the buffalo ones, but just kind of like a tip and trick, you guys can get a sauce and just put it over top, I'm pretty sure it's still less calories. And I was actually comparing, you guys, these breaded ones over here by Pinty's, and they're actually 40 calories less overall for two pieces, so I think I'm gonna try these out. Do you guys know where we're headed? <laughs> Our famous almond milk. Um, bum bum bum. Organic, unsweetened, July 27. That'll do. It's a no salt one. See, I already have a no salt mentality, so I'm gonna get two of these. And my black beans are on sale for 99 cents, so I'm just gonna get another one. So I needed mayo, you guys. I'm gonna try this one by compliments called Balance Mayonnaise Style Dressing. 
and it's only 35 calories I do want definitely a lower option just because I like to put a lot when I'm making my sandwiches so I'm gonna go with that one and I think the last thing on our list is I think that's it yeah that's it but I need to stop at Walmart so we're gonna go there next so everything's been going good with my sodium but I find that I'm needing to eat more frequently or else I do start getting like that weak sort of feeling I'm gonna eat I'm gonna go to Walmart. I need sunscreen for my trip. I really, really need sunscreen because it's gonna be like super hot, I'm assuming. Okay, yeah, these are, okay, wow. Yeah, these are bigger. I only have to use one. So per one piece for my sandwich, it's only gonna be 100 calories. I'm such a sauce person. So every time I go to McDonald's and I get my chicken sandwich, I love hot mustard that they have. Love, love, love it. So I got this one that says sweet and spicy prepared mustard and it's actually really low calorie. That's what I love about mustard. It's actually a really good like low calorie sauce if you guys love it. The other thing I got that I'm going to try, I've never tried this guy before, is creamy horseradish. A lot of you guys ask me where I get this one. This was that aioli or aioli, aioli horseradish that I got from before from Whole Foods but apparently they don't have them anymore. So because that one says horseradish, I'm also going to try this one and see how they kind of compare. So I just tasted it, you guys. It is just a little bit more tangy than the other one is. But that's the thing with horseradish. It is very, very like tangy. I think I'm going to use this as a substitute, but it is super, super close to the other one. What I did to the other one is I actually added water to kind of lower down the calories. It says here per two tablespoons is 45 calories. The other one is like 100 calories, I think, just for one tablespoon. I actually put one of the fillets on a plate and I put it inside of the microwave for about two minutes and then I heat up a pan on the side and that's how we're going to get like all golden and cook it up there. Just because when it's frozen, it takes forever. So I warm it up first and now we're going to add it into our pan over here. You guys, this tastes so similar to the McDonald's hot mustard. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. I'm not going to really measure. You guys can measure if you want to. I'm kind of on a maintenance right now. So that's how much I'm going to be putting. Our chicken is kind of getting golden up in here. So excited to try these. These ones are way bigger than the actual Jane ones. Look how good that looks. Oh my gosh. I am so hungry and it is literally 1120. Like I have been getting super super hungry so fast and then i'll hold off until like the evening it's so weird this sandwich tastes like a crispy chicken sandwich like these fillets are so good this is not the first time i bought something from pinty's before god i have such bad memory yes chicken breast fillets they were by pinty's it tastes like i just went i'm not like i'm, I'm serious i'm not lying to you it tastes like i went to kfc i just ordered a crispy chicken sandwich this went well so good you guys. I felt like I just went to McDonald's. It's so weird. My mom found this article that if you put baby powder that ants won't come like inside of your room and stuff. So I literally as soon as they passed it today I was like oh I'm getting that. Look what I found. I found my lean turkey pepperoni sticks. They are 50 calories each and they have 290 milligrams of sodium inside of them. I'd be such a really good like sodium boost if I need it on the go I can just put like two inside of a plastic Ziploc bag and bring it with me this sunscreen the 110 I looked it up on Google to see like if 100 SPF even works because there's always that debate it's actually like it only covers 1% more than the 50 60 one it doesn't do that that much more but I think I have it like stuck in my head because one time I went to Cuba and I wore the 100 and I actually didn't get burnt at all and I was in the sun. I got this one more for my face and when I'm kind of like traveling and I don't want to carry like a big bottle. But I got this one to put all over my body because I feel like this is such a small bottle. And they were the exact same price, you guys. They both were around $13. This one is the sport one and it says 50 plus SPF by Umbrell. A lot of people have really good reviews about Umbrell, but a lot of people really like Neutrogena as well. I just really needed some sunscreen because I got really badly burned to Niagara and I didn't put any on because I'm like super lazy when it comes to sunscreen. I picked up some dark chocolate covered almonds. I love these, especially right now, like around the time of the month. You just like, I just crave something sweet so bad. And Mama, what are you doing, Mama? You're so silly. You like being in the sun, Mama? I know. Huge part of me is like, go out because you want to. And the other part of me is like, this cramp is stopping you and telling you to stay home. So I'm not really sure what I'm going to do, you guys. But I think if I am going to go out, I don't, maybe I'll get like my hot green tea. I feel like something hot, just like my mom always told me that. And my grandma, like something hot will soothe this tummy. I can't even talk straight, you guys. Like I'm just, 
the cramp is just unreal i don't really have cramps to be honest with you guys like month to month i'm not really like that just i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog make sure you guys give it a big thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you guys are not following me on ig it is steph g macedo so make sure you guys follow me thank you guys so much for watching and i will see all of my beautiful babes in my next video